All right, brothers, we are in the car at Women's, actually, waiting for John to get back. John is the OG lifting partner, the one first guy that gains in me in the glorious House of Iron. So he and I linked up recently. It's been a long time since we hung out. Um, just both got really busy. Oh, there he is in the back. Just both got really busy. And so we're hitting a Metroflex lift now. Just tell them about you, John. How's it going? Hey, what's up? Hey. So John and I, we had a powerlifting club together. How long ago was that? Uh, I don't even know. Three years ago? Three years. That sounds about right. Powerlifting club three years ago, and I think we did it for two years total. Um, and then you were out, and then COVID hit, and then all that stuff went yeah. down. Um, but, you know, we were in here during the winter hitting lifts. We were hitting there in the summer hitting lifts. Um, probably for like two years straight. Like, we were very consistent, yeah, sure. especially in the summer. We would both get, like, super hyped off of a pre-workout in the car, listen to loud music <laughs> on our way to the gym. There's one time when I was biking. And you picked me up because it was like freezing outside. You remember that? Oh yeah. Yeah, I, I I biked to the gym there, and it literally took everything out of me because the wind. It was like twenty degrees. Um, the wind was just hounding, like hitting me the whole way there. And then you just picked up me up and like drove me on the way back, which is just just one of the things sure, I remembered. Uh, born away in uh, Metroflex, and so to hit a high intensity upper body day, he's doing shoulders. I'm doing chest, triceps, and. Maybe some other, I don't know, not yeah. arms, biceps, destroyed your biceps yesterday. Traps, maybe. Traps, maybe. Oh, yeah, get, get first that. Time, first time going there, too. So yeah, it, it'll be cool seeing see what how, he thinks of it. See how it feels. We'll get the isosceles triangles implanted in our shoulders for the traps. <laughs> Lose our necks completely because. Oh, my gosh. Literally, literally, it's going to be a good time. But I'll see you guys when we're there. She rolling, I'm holding my scrotum imposing. This voice here is golden, so fuck y'all, I go in. And all my life I want money and power. Respect my mind or die from less shout. I pray my dick get big as the apple top, so I can fuck the world for 72 hours. God damn, I got bitches. Damn, I got bitches. Damn, I got bitches. Wifey, girlfriend, and mistress. All my life I want money and power. Respect my mind or nigga. It's go time, I'm rolling down with a good grind And I'm running home with a blue tie And it's a relay race with a bouquet They say, can you go marry mine? Like, biatch, biatch, biatch No way, biatch Okay, you never live a life of fun It's a failure, even if we're blind I can tell you who what we wear How to sell your game right on time Biatch, okay, biatch, okay, biatch Okay, biatch, I look like I'm just killing everything for pussy To my fucking head, I'm just a pussy Alright, we are back in the crib. Workout, John, how'd you do today? 
pretty decent. It was good. Um, I'm still, I still have a pump in the shoulder, still have a pump in the biceps, still a pump in the triceps. Took some great photos at the end. Um, the car ride back is long. Like, I'm so, I'm so f hungry, dude. So hungry. Uh, I need it, but, dude, it was good. There's so much, it's a dirty gym. But there's some, I got some dirt on me right now. That's fine, though, because the gains, they were worth it. They were worth it. Um, but what are you going to eat when you get home? I got chicken breast probably. Chicken breast probably. That's what I'm gonna do. Maybe got, an omelet. I don't know. I'm, dude. Both are good. I'm gonna. How about an omelet and chicken breasts, and then a protein shake and 15 raw eggs and three three <laughs> gallons of milk and a full jar of peanut butter uh, and a protein bar. Yeah. yeah. Sounds, like sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. All right. We're both tired, so we're gonna get back to you guys in yeah. some time. I don't know when. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a great day. Peace. All right, guys. Colin, he's had two bangs already today, and this man is an addict. I swear to God. And he's trying to drink my rock stars that I bought. I'm not going to let him. I'm not going to let him indulge Jacob, into his addict. Oh, God. Where's the rock star, Jacob? I need it. You guys don't know where the rock is, Jacob. He's right there. I'm gonna hide. I see you. No! Stay away! No! Can't make noise until after midnight. I think because <clears throat> Mans said that. Or Mans was like. Coming in at 12 one time and breaking apart in our spot like a dumb, dumb butt. Yeah. Well, if he comes up, we'll just bring up the incident from earlier. Exactly. And then probably get shot. We don't we don't condone violence on women and that man downstairs. We apparently. Don't, we don't know for sure, but uh, Jacob texts me and he's like, dude, this is an emergency. And apparently the guy downstairs, I don't know, there's some fight going on or something. And his girl screamed, call 911, which is like a man, if someone screams, call nine one one. That that's that's serious. That's some like. I jolted out of bed, and then as soon as I jolted out, I just like literally stomped. I was like, shh, 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 like stomping on the floor, and then I go, I'm calling the cops, <laughs> and I literally called the cops, and I'm like, um, nine one one. Here's my address. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you guys what the address is. Obviously. Now we live like, on your mom's road. After that, he was like, all right, what's going on? And I was like, there might be a domestic issue going down downstairs. I forget what the number was. I know what the number is now. But I was like, it's the one right below me. And it's like, as soon as you get in, it's to the right. And then they come and they're like, is everything okay? And then they're like, yeah, everything's fine. And then they literally leave. They leave. I'm sketchy shit. And I literally heard like arguing for an entire half hour. I woke up to to hearing the arguments. <laughs> yeah. Well, we respect women in these parts, and if we see that guy acting up, I, I don't know what we're gonna do because we don't get violence. We're both gonna walk up to that door, guns blazing. We're gonna, we're gonna be like, "Hey, are you harming ladies down here? <laughs> are you harming ladies down here? <laughs> Plural, <laughs> multiple women." <laughs> Well, hey, yeah, so we're going to go probably work out now and then watch a movie. I don't know what we're going to watch, but apparently there's like face track on this camera. Like, look at this, bro. Oh, oh, oh. watch, 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 watch. Apparently it's on, okay, I don't, I don't even know anymore. It doesn't like my face, apparently. Uh, but I have had about a gram of caffeine in the last hour. There is 100 milligrams in a addict. cup of coffee. I'm not an addict, bro. You're the addict. What are you talking about? I'm not the addict. I'm not, I'm not an addict. I don't need my fix at all. Oh god, everything itches. Jacob, where do you have the energy drinks? I don't know. All right, guys. So we're we're, we're recording a YouTube video uh, where I go on a Tinder, pretty much as this like asshole named Bryce. Um, problem is, you know, this account has actually become serious. I'm not trying to hook up or anything with any of these girls, but like when I'm trying to talk to like a cute girl, you know, it's it's kind of it comes in handy because, you know, just relationships and all that and i like talking to people anyways problem is um i can't actually like meet these girls and like not come out as like a sociopath because <laughs> like imagine this imagine this 
Hey, good, nice to meet you, Sarah. My name is actually not Bryce. And then just like look the this look of horror on their face as they like think they're about to be murdered by a, a serial killer. Or imagine you talking to this guy named Bryce, and then she sends you her Snapchat, which has and, literally happened. And then you 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 get an ad from a guy named Colin. <laughs> I did that, bro. I did no, no. I, the, one of the girls, she sends me her Snapchat. I'm, I added her. And I'm like, hey, so my name's not actually Bryce. And it was just immediately off. Oh my That's happened like seven times, dude. There's this, oh, this really cute girl named Emma from Madison. She adds me on here. And, uh, oh, oh, anyways. Uh, <laughs> and she adds me, she adds me on, she adds me on Tinder. Or I, it swipes back on me. And, um, sends me her Snapchat. And I go, um, I don't have Snapchat. It just immediately unadds. It's like, do I have to have Snapchat to be attractive? Um, regardless, though, I mean, it's it kind of does like help me avoid like the the awkward "Hey, my name's not actually Bryce" talk. I um, told him that he should change his bio to "I'm sorry, my name is not Bryce, it is Colin." <laughs> actually, asterisks actually not Bryce is Colin. <laughs> but, Just asterisks Colin. <laughs> asterisks. Uh, no, it's or or legally get a name change to Bryce, oh, so yeah. I can just assume that that that'd be some. That. I could not call you Bryce. That is not. That is not. <laughs> my my uh, my acquaintances know me as Bryce, but my real friends know me as Colin. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mr. Mr. Colin. Mr. Jacob, we are going to head to the gym soon after you watch your Naruto. It's Boruto. Boruto. Okay, get, get out of here. You and your anime sh- Don't you f***ing dare. Get out. Get out. Get out. Oh, you're terrible. You're terrible. Um, but yeah, wish me... <laughs> Wish me luck on the dating game. Uh, I honestly just... Don't tri- post that. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Jacob, I am posting every single part of that. <laughs>